Oh. Your last minute goal won it for us. High five time! High five. High five. High five. High five. High five. Good job, champs. See you at practice on Monday, bright eyed and bushy tailed. <laughs> You did it, Daniel! You scored a goal! Wait, what are you doing? Nothing. I always wash my hands 17 times after a match. Don't you? <laughs> Daniel! Oh. The others were so happy, I didn't want to tell them. I didn't do it on purpose, Erico. I scored the goal with my head! <laughs> yeah? You scored a goal. With my head! What, is that it? <laughs> Listen, Daniel, handballs happen all the time. They do? So I didn't do anything wrong? Everything's okay. Thanks, Erico. What a relief. Eh? I can't wait to tell Whoa. everyone. Uh, you're kidding, right? But you said everything was okay. Rule number one, if you cheat, no one should know about it. Ever. I cheated? And now I have to lie as well! To everybody, Daniel. You'll see. It's easy. Think of this cupcake as the truth, okay? Put it in your mouth. Oh. Swallow it. And keep it down. Easy, right? Yeah! It's just jam. No need to worry. Somebody knows, Erico. How do you explain all these anonymous letters? And the backyard? And the voicemail messages? I know what you did, Daniel. I know what you did, Daniel. Nah, you're reading too much into it. And that's not all. Mom Shampoo is nowhere to be found. Oh, yeah? Your mom has shampoo. That's, uh, that's funny. I hadn't even noticed. Someone left us these messages! Someone knows about my handball! Ah, oh, kids. Okay, if you insist, we can check the security feed. What? You put cameras up all around my house? Yep, and I put some up at the Stevens house, too. Ugh, back to us. Wait till you see the image quality. A feast for the eyes. See? Nothing. You're imagining things. Wait a sec. Rewind again. Stop! Zoom there! Wait, is that... you? I know what you did, Daniel. I know what you did, Daniel. What? Uh, what? The cupcake has possessed me! It's trying to get the truth out in my sleep. I can't ever sleep again, Erico. Ever. Oh, Daniel. Relax. We'll figure something out. There's always a way. <laughs> <laughs> Okie doke. You're good. Sweet dreams, Daniel. Sleep tight. Sweet dreams, Erico. Huh? Daniel? Oh, no. D Daniel! Ninety-nine. <laughs> is... is someone there? Stefan, you really spooked me there. 
Time to go to sleep now. No, no arguing. <sighs> Good night, Stefan! Ah! Daniel, but practice is tomorrow, you know. You're nine hours early. I scored with my hand. I'm not worthy, a cheater. My hand! <laughs> I can't understand a word you're saying! One of these days, I'll forget my head. What were you saying, Daniel? I scored with my... my... Hey. Maple? What am I doing here? I don't know. Were you trying to tell me something? Oh, wow, was I? <laughs> well, I, uh... I love your pajamas. Good night. Oh, that's nice. I was worried they were too small. I got them at a thrift shop right near the station and... Oh, he's gone. I can't go on like this, Erico. I can't keep the cupcake down. I need to tell the truth. Oh, Daniel. Do you think I would let my best friend down like that? <gasps> this is my ultra safe hideout. It came free with the security cams. Lock yourself in there every night for the rest of your life, and bingo. Problem solved. Wow! Thanks, Erico. You really are the best friend I've ever had. Oh, no, no, not the... Hug time! <laughs> that smell. Vanilla and cinnamon. A delicate hint of lemongrass. That smell, just like mom shampoo! <laughs> what? I never stole your mom's shampoo! No way! Erico? Okay, fine, I stole your mom's shampoo! You happy now? Do you think I feel better because I told the truth? <sighs> Actually, yeah, yeah, yeah! I do feel much better. I've never felt like this before. You mean you've never admitted to a lie in your entire life? Nope. I lied to my coaches, to my teammates, to my lawyers, to my sponsors. You too, Daniel. Huh? Why did no one ever tell me how good it feels to tell the truth? <sighs> do you think they'll forgive me? Of course they will. It's just one tiny little goal. Huh? Is anybody there? Surprise! Daniel! 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 Congratulations, Daniel. We wanted to thank you for giving us hope again with your miraculous goal. And this is from me. You've really boosted everyone's confidence, Daniel. I did at least two push-ups this morning. And even my dad is cool now. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to you, I've decided to follow my dreams to be the president of the world! <laughs> Thanks a lot, but uh, I have something to tell you guys. Daniel, are you okay? Lights and action! Uh, what I wanted, uh, wanted. What I wanted to say was... I scored the goal with my hand by accident and then we won and I didn't say anything because you were all so happy! Well then, I guess the party's over. Did someone keep the receipt for the apple juice? I lied, too. I only did one push-up. And I don't actually want to be a world leader. It's too much pressure. I want a simple life. I can't see anything with these shades! Sometimes I listen to world music. I act tough, but I really like you guys! I live in the gym! Uh, yeah, we know. Hmm? We, we lie! Well, thanks, Daniel. The truth has finally set us free.
We might not be winners, but at least we're champions at telling the truth. Uh, <laughs> I guess. Feels good, don't it? Sure does. I'll never lie again. Nope, me neither. Was that a lie? <laughs> Come on, Daniel! You're a wall! A bulldozer! <laughs> <laughs> Touch him! <laughs> Sorry, Larry. I don't know my own strength. Stop that! Can't you see that he's faking it? You're heartless, Erico. Look at him. He may never walk again. Uh, why, Daniel? Why? Penalty. Huh? <laughs> It looks so real. How did you know he was faking it? Ah, oh, Daniel. It comes down to experience and technology. Ow! Oh! <clears throat> huh? Huh? Hmm? <laughs> My leg! <gasps> the cheater! No, Daniel. To become a pro, you have to know how to act. Start with the classics. Ancient plays, Italian drama, La Commedia dell'arte. The what? <laughs> oh, anger. Oh, despair. Oh, age, my enemy. Whitened by the toil of battles, to witness in a day but withered laurels? Go, leave now the very least of men, pass into better hands, take my revenge. <laughs> <laughs> than to take my life? Uh. <gasps> A what? I didn't even touch him. Even with gloves on, I wouldn't touch him. The grand finale, Daniel. Larry. <coughs> I forgive you. <coughs> Hang in there, Daniel. They're waiting for you at the ER. So, young man, you've got a big owie? Um, no! It's much better already, thanks! I think I'm good to go! Wow! <gasps> okay, take a deep breath for me. But uh, I feel fine, I swear! Uh, very well, we're just going to do a few little extra tests. That's enough, Erico. Let's get out of here now! Are you kidding? If you can fake it here, you can fake it anywhere. That's amazing practice. How are you, sweetie? Mom? Doctor, is it serious? We don't know what's wrong yet, but we'll find out eventually. Be brave, baby. Mommy's here. Even if she hurts hospitals. Oh. <laughs> No time to lose. We're transferring him immediately to the Unknown Diseases Ward. But there's no reason to worry. We got you a fruit basket, but Stephen ate the papayas. Okay, guys. Let's leave Daniel in peace. Get well soon, little guy. <laughs> 
Jericho, I shouldn't be here. This has gone way too far. It's up to you, Daniel. Either you admit to lying to the doctors, to all your friends, your coach, your mom. <gasps> or we stay here for just a week or two and chow down on chocolate and passion fruit. Ow. <laughs> Enjoy it while it lasts, kid. I've been here for years, and they still don't know what's wrong with my leg. Like me with this itching. Then again, it could be worse. Welcome to the Unknown Diseases Ward. Fruit Jelly? I know that guy. Daniel! Simon, Simon Bullock! The football superstar? The sham playing in my position? He's so classy. And so nice, too. Such lame hair. I heard all about your accident, Daniel. It's all over the news. Huge concern. Uh, that's really nice. But, you know, it's not that bad, in fact. Huge courage. I've decided to start a foundation to help you. The Daniel Foundation. Huge project. But isn't that the check you promised to save the planet? The planet can wait. The stakes here are just too, uh, huge. <laughs> It's no use, Eriko. I could never tell the truth in front of real sick people. I'm gonna stay in the hospital forever. In the hospital! Meh, it's not so bad here. <laughs> hey, kid, want some light cheese? Hey, cool it over there, huh? Want a massage and my World Cup trophy while you're at it? <laughs> huh? A World Cup? I know where I've seen that guy before. I played against him in the finals. I didn't even touch him, and I got a red card. It was the only World Cup I didn't win. Comedia dell'arte. He was faking it! He stole my cup! What? Faking an injury? The nerve of that guy! Hmm. Oh. Uh, no, it's not the same. Oh. Show's over. I'm going to tell everyone the truth. Faking is cheating! I wouldn't do that if I were you, kid. Wait, you're on your feet? It's a miracle! No, oh, they're all faking. They were never sick in the first place. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> No one can ever know we're faking. Yeah, we like it here. We get three square meals a day and an afternoon stroll. We're not coming clean now. <laughs> Let me out of here! You're one of us now. If you speak, you'll be denouncing all of us. <laughs> hmm? hmm. Comedia dell'arte. Ah! My wrist! Why? I'm just a kid! Oh no! What have we done? Can't you see he's faking it? Comedia dell'arte. <laughs> you stole his trophy? He stole it from me first! An eye for an eye!
my leg. Why? What have I ever done to you? <gasps> Goodbye, my beauty. No! My cup! That's disgraceful! Thanks, Erico. You owe me a World Cup. <clears throat> we'll be having a very long talk about this, Daniel Sisu. Upon reconsideration, this check will go back to saving the planet. Well then, I've come to a big decision. To prevent any more faking, no more fouls will be given. But Maple, aren't you worried we'll descend into violence and barbarism? <laughs> ah, what a beautiful game. <laughs> surprise! Hmm? I said surprise! Yeah, one second, Daniel. I'm talking to my friends. Get this! My followers remember the anniversary of my 1,000th goal! <gasps> Those are some real what? friends! What do you mean, your followers? All the people who follow me online. They share my photos, comment on my videos, like my gifts. They're the best friends I've ever had. But they're not your friends. You don't even know them. Oh, yeah? You're telling me that isn't friendship? Well, I have real friends. So who wants to go for a hot chocolate, guys? Hmm. Hmm? Ah, oh, Steven replied. Sorry, Daniel. I'm stuck in the office. Hmm. It's okay. Good luck with all your work. Hmm? Steven? Huh? <laughs> you were saying? Fine. But did your followers organize an amazing party for the anniversary of your 1,000th goal? A party? <laughs> Big limo! That sure is a nice limousine. Hurry up, we're gonna miss the bus. Huh? Big party! That sure is a lot of people. Come on, we're going this way. Huh? Big buffet! That sure is appetizing. Maple rents out the room for weddings. <laughs> Yo, Daniel! Ready for your surprise? Happy 1,000th goal anniversary, Erico! <laughs> Want some cake? Cake? No caviar? No magician? I scored a thousand goals, Daniel, and there's only one candle on that cake! But it's a magic candle which never goes out. Like our friendship. All my followers agree your party is lame. But what's important is to be together, right? Yeah, I'll show you what's important. Super Platana party at my mansion. Hashtag anniversary. Hashtag 1,000th goal. Hashtag no limits. You invited two million people? Boom! Now we just need a theme. Well, you scored your 1,000th goal against France, so the theme could be... France! <laughs> I love these guys. Real friends right there. Friends with ideas. <laughs> okay, light it all up. So, do you like it? Blue, white, and red. My followers think it's a bit cliché. Any chance some of them can lend a hand instead of just making comments? Are you kidding? They're helping non-stop. They even sent us this inflatable, life-sized Eiffel Tower! Oh, cool! <laughs> it won't inflate itself, you know. 
Thousandth goal, Daniel. Thousandth goal. <sighs> Erica, hmm? look. I folded all the napkins into France's national symbol, a rooster. <laughs> hmm. My followers think it has more of a pheasant vibe. But I've already folded them all. Thousandth goal, Daniel. Thousandth goal. Wah. Don't listen to him. You're not a pheasant. You're a beautiful rooster. Ah, not bad, huh? <laughs> Whoa! Do you like it? I went with almond mousseline base, covered with praline chocolate frosting, and filled with lemon pistachio cream. I even topped it with a chocolate ball. Hey, great idea. <laughs> I love these guys. What are you doing? I'm gonna hide inside the cake so I can surprise my guests. Hashtag no limits. But you're a ball. No one will get it. Thousandth goal, Daniel. Thousandth goal. <laughs> <laughs> Hours making the pistachio cream and the biscuit base. <laughs> if I may, your creamy filling is a little sticky. That's it! I've had enough of your followers and their stupid ideas! You can throw your own party! What? So now I'm supposed to turn on the disco ball all by myself? Is that it? <laughs> no, darn it, I forgot my beret. <laughs> 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 No need to panic, Platana. You're just stuck inside a giant cake, that's all. Okay, no network. Stay calm. Okay, it's not working. Panic. Oh yeah, how loud! Hey! Anyone there? I'm in here! Oh, those decorations are awful. Whose house is this anyway? Then I'll. Here, give me those golden bowls. I'll put the chips in them. You know! Not my trophies! <sighs> um, sorry, Daniel, but you're kind of killing the vibe. Would you mind taking your size outside? Hmm? <clears throat> SUV! My swimming pool! Hey, we're out of food! Nothing to drink either! This party's lame! Okay, everyone, there's a wedding in a gymnasium not far from here! Hashtag buffet! Wait! Get me out of here! Aha, network! Beat it, parasites! Hmm? The battery's dead! I'm gonna finish my days inside a gigantic cake! Um, fruity note. 
Erico? I, Erico Platana, bequeath my entire fortune to the only friend who's never betrayed me. <gasps> Myself. And I leave this cake to a little man with quite an appetite. Daniel, take my lucky shorts as well. I hope you become a great champion. Erico? Daniel, is that you? I'll get hmm? you out of there, Erico. Hold on. <laughs> don't bother, I'm fine. I don't need you. I'm having a ball in here. <laughs> Party! <laughs> Daniel? You're still there? Daniel, come back! I was wrong! I need you! You're a much better friend than all my followers put together! <laughs> Daniel! Erica! <laughs> Best friends forever. Daniel Sisu takes the ball forward, into the box, passes to his teammate and best friend, Erico! Ah, new comment. Mm. Hmm. <gasps> this time, you score. up with a new look. Laundry day. The only thing left was my chic suit. <laughs> hmm? You call that chic? Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. Clothes are my thing. You know what they call me? King drama? Master red card? The backstabber. What? Hmm? No. My other nickname. Big Chin? No. Style Man, the Prince of Fashion. Okay, we gotta go shopping. Yeah! Uh, I'm not sure about this, Erico. No, oh, you look marvelous. Stylish, suave, masculine. <laughs> Makes me want to call you Monsieur. I'm off to work. Mm -hmm. There's some leftover lasagna in the fridge. <gasps> Daniel, what are you doing dressed like that? Are you in a gang? You don't like it? <laughs> mm. This cost a fortune. Where did you get the money for this? <gasps> Don't tell me you're bullying your friends from football and taking their money. What? No way! No, oh, you're turning into a delinquent and it's all my fault. Ever since I took on that third job, we barely see each other anymore. You know what? I'll take the day off and we can go to the movies. All right, sweetie. Uh, Mom... Check it. The new robot combat fighter is out. The explosions are in 3D. <laughs> Sweet dreams in 2D, honey. Mm, good night, Mom. Yeah! yeah! Best day, day ever! ever! And all because your mom thinks you're going astray. <laughs> <laughs> Me, a gangster. <laughs> mm, are you thinking what I'm thinking, Daniel? Hmm. Didn't you want to go to the carnival? No, Erico. Lying to Mom is wrong. Daniel? What were you thinking? I don't know what's gotten into him recently. It seems pretty clear to me. A kid needs his mom. Take him to the carnival or go-karting. Or out for a meal. Oh, Chinese would be great. <sighs> what am I going to do with you, Daniel Sisu? <sighs> okay, grab your coat. We're going out to dinner. <laughs> Daniel.
Daniel, I'm getting really worried about you. You're not just doing this so we spend more time together, are you? <laughs> no, no! I don't know why. I just can't keep out of trouble. <sighs> I got mixed up in some bad stuff when I was your age, too. Believe me, it's not worth it. So, time to toe the line, okay, honey? I promise, Mom. Mm -hmm. Good night, bad boy. Are you a deep sea diving or winter sports kind of guy? Winter sports? Deep sea diving. Deep sea diving. Winter sports? No, Erico, it's over now. You don't mean that. Your mom's so close to taking us on vacation. I don't want to lie to her anymore. My thug life is over. Okay, Daniel. You leave me no choice. Time to get up, sleepyhead. Breakfast is ready. <gasps> <sighs> it wasn't me, Mom! <laughs> hey, what's the problem? Daniel, tropical paradise, here we come! What did you do this for? And where did you get all this money? Relax, it's all fake. The armored truck, the cash, even the Italian <laughs> shoes. Hmm? Uh. Okay, Daniel, I get it. This is the life you want, and there's nothing I can do to change that. But I'm still your mother! If you can't help but become a criminal, we'll do it together as a family. Come on, get in. Hmm? Mom, I don't think this is such a good idea. The Sisu crew is in the... Buckle up, honey. The Sisu crew is in the house! You okay, Daniel? Still up for the thug life? <laughs> you just wait here for a second, okay, sweetie? Mama's gonna rob a bank. She's bluffing. You don't really buy her gangster act, do ya? She's not gonna do it. Huh? Oh, that's my money! Oh, oh no! She, she did, did it! it. Yeah, uh, how old's your mom? 30-something. Yes, a 30-something woman, short hair, the car has flames on the side, come quick. Hey! You can't tell on her! She's my mom! Yeah. <laughs> Thing I know a guy. Yeah, right, I know. It's been quite a while. Your mom's gone crazy, Daniel! Tell her the truth! But then she'll know I lied! Who cares? This has gone too far! Tell her! <laughs> you okay, Daniel? Nothing to tell me? Uh, uh, uh. Okay, off we go. The mountain is waiting for us. Are we going skiing? <laughs> <laughs> no. The mountain is the most wanted criminal in the city. Go bad, just run and don't look back. Got it? I can't leave her alone. 
Nope, stay here, Daniel. That guy looks really dangerous. You got the cash? I gotta help my mom! It's too late for that, Daniel! Let go of the bag! We can still make it out of here if we get rid of it! No bag, no evidence, no problem! <laughs> You're under arrest! <laughs> the mountain's a cop! We gotta move it fast! <laughs> Nothing to tell me, Daniel. As you wish. I made it all up to you and spent time with me. I'm sorry, I lied. Daniel Sisu, promise me you'll never lie to me again. I promise, Bobby. Please, get out of the vehicle with your hands up. I don't want to go to jail! <laughs> Mom's in trouble with the cops, and it's all because of us. <sighs> Bobby! It's all good, boys. I think he got it. <laughs> <laughs> What? Dirty laundry? I don't believe you've met my friends from the drama club. I want this room spotless by the time I get back. I'm counting on you, Daniel. Mom really got us good, didn't she? I was so scared, weren't you? Lizana doesn't know fear. I left it in the locker room a long time ago. Oh, hi! You're under arrest! Don't shoot! I'm famous! <laughs> yeah, very funny, Daniel. <laughs> Give it up, Daniel! This time you are going down. Kukukuku Combo! Supreme Humiliation! No! Controller's broken! Give me yours! I'm off, sweetheart. Have a good day with your best friend. <laughs> what do you mean, Mom? It's just me. Oh, Daniel. How could you forget Mr. Tickles? Oh, yeah! <laughs> Mr. Tickles sure is my best friend in the world. Be good, you two. And not too much TV, okay? Maybe you want a little space just for you and your best friend. Come on, Erico. Mr. Tickles is just my cuddly toy. Didn't you ever have one? My cuddly toy? I had completely forgotten. Such a nice smell. Like vanilla and warm bread. Had a little mustache. And actively took part in several revolutions. Huh? Abuelita, my old nanny. She's the one who looked after me when I was little. Anyway, that's all in the past. Who knows where she is today? Hmm. Hmm. Old Nanny. Hmm. Platana. <gasps> Daniel, you know I hate surprises. Abuelita! Kill me, Fabas Titi. Abuelita! I can't believe it! I've missed you so much! Miti Mavestranjan. Zongoi. Seti ju treamusas. She says that I'm too skinny and that we'll need to fat me up. Are you sure she can see well? Oh, Pichu Pluma de Caboso. Chopolo Bamba Marcia Baila. There's so much to tell you. So many victories, zero defeats, some doubts. <laughs> some doubts.
Ah, Daniel, this is kind of personal. Could you give us a little space, please? Back up. More? The door. Can I come back now? No! How about now? No! How? No! Uh, there we go. Unchanged over the centuries, fly fishing is more than just a sport. For some fly fishermen, it's Can we switch art. to cartoons instead? Abuelita loves documentaries. The laws are often made by the fly fishermen themselves, mm. taking long hours of meticulous preparation. <laughs> That's the end of our program. And now, a look at the reproductive cycle <sighs> of jellyfish. Contrary to popular belief, jellyfish do... <gasps> what? Already? We've got to take Abuelita back to her retirement home. <sighs> Look, she's sleeping. We don't want to disturb her. Mm. Hey, where am I gonna sleep? Shh! Old people's sleep is sacred. She's so adorable when she sleeps. There we go. I've got tickets for mini motorcycling. Awesome! Oops, but I only have two. Looks like Abuelita will have to go back to the retirement home. Hmm? But it's too rough for someone her age. You kidding? She survived several wars. What's a mini bike track to her? Hey, Daniel, do you like donuts? <laughs> What's that? Practice! She played for the national team. Still in good shape, huh? Kian me faras chichi. Abuelita! Abuelita! Tomorrow we can squeeze in canoeing just after laser tag if we don't spend too long bowling. What? But we were supposed to go to the game together tomorrow! I even got us matching ball caps. You want us to just leave, Abuelita? Have you no heart? That does it! Ever since Abuelita got here, you've spent all your time with her! Come on, why so jealous, Daniel? You haven't seen Daniel, have you? Please disappoint me. Don't tell me he's still sulking. <laughs> ah! Daniel? What are you doing? Since you like Abuelita better, I decided to become an old lady, too. Take that wig off. You look ridiculous, Daniel. Hmm. Abuelita, I hope you and Erico are happy! Still no news of Mrs. Silvia Martinez, who has disappeared from her retirement home. Mom has never done this before. The kids are absolutely devastated. Silvia, that's mi filino. Erico, are you really, really sure that this is Abuelita? Now that you mention it, her eyes were green, and she had a wooden leg. What? Hey, you're the one who told me it was her. 
I wasn't sure, but you seemed so happy. That means... We've kidnapped an old lady! Okay, we need to take her back, right now! But everybody's looking for her, Eriko! If somebody recognizes her outside, we're gonna go to prison! To prison! If you have any information regarding the disappearance of Mrs. Martinez, please contact the police immediately. No! Okay, stop, stop. We're gonna find a solution, Daniel. Orange doesn't suit me at all. Ugh, and close that window! Abuelita's gonna catch a cold. Old people's health is sacred, Daniel. Oh no, my hat! My scarf as well! And my funny glasses! Hmm. Coast is clear, Erico. It's you! I know you. I saw you on TV. The dress of my dreams! <sighs> there you are! I knew I'd find you! My self-esteem. Wait, 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 wait! Forgetting your bus ticket? <sighs> wait, 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 wait! You think I don't see what's going on with your old mustachioed friend? He gets a senior citizen discount! <sighs> wait, 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 wait! Have a splendid day! One. Uh, a little too festive, right? <laughs> ah, there you go. That one's scary. Phew. We drop her here, ring the bell, and run for it. Ready, Daniel? <laughs> what are you waiting for? I can't do this. I just can't leave Abuelita like this. But she's not Abuelita. How would you know? You said she had a wooden leg! Well, lizard's tails grow back! Abuelita, you want to go? Vima truffles means tulta bando. Mrs. Martinez, we were so worried about you. That's it. She's gone now. So what did she say when she was hugging us? She said that as we go forward in life, leaving memories behind, we should keep them in our hearts and learn to cherish them. Aww. It was either that or let me go inside. It's freezing out here. <laughs> I'm not sure. Daniel, don't you think this trophy used to be shinier? What are you watching? Something amazing! Don't forget to subscribe and to smash that like button. Finger football! <laughs> Finger football? <laughs> That's baloney, Daniel. Nobody can do that with just his fingers. Sure you can. Look, it's easy. Wait, wait, wait. Let me try. If you can do it, anybody can. Oh, yeah. Try to go lighter on your joints, Erico. Hey, I'm the football star here, okay? You think you're better than me? <laughs> oh, no. He is better than me. No! I'm a superstar! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Calm down there, Mr. Big Head. What if I film you, superstar? How will you take the pressure then? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What if I post it online? Then what? <laughs> Daniel Sisu, is that you in this video, little guy? How'd you like to play for the national team? Me? Him? Our top striker broke a nail. 
When I saw your video, I knew I'd found his replacement. Welcome to the big leagues, Daniel. Welcome to the World Cup. Wow! The stadium is going crazy tonight! Wow! Yeah, finger football. World Cup. What a joke. Ready to meet the team? Guys, let me introduce you to the amazing prodigy I was telling you about. Uh, hi. I'm Daniel. Hey. Okay, team, hop, hop, hop. We're on in five. Hold on there, Daniel. You sure about this? Of course I am, Eriko. The team needs me. <sighs> Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. These guys are pros. You could easily mess everything up. You think? The first match is the moment of truth. If you're not up to it, it'll show. But hey, I don't want to pressure you. <laughs> goal! Daniel Sisu scores his fifth goal! What a game! Seriously? And then, the goalie didn't see that I'd taken the shot, so I thought I'd make the right move. And then... <laughs> Ah, how is he doing it? Everything okay, Erico? Perfect! Just perfect! But don't get too big-headed now. The first match is always the easiest. It is? But I thought you said... I say a lot of things, okay? You had some beginner's luck. The hard part starts now. If it all ends in tears, Daniel, don't go crying to me. Another victory for Daniel! Sisu! Everything this little guy touches turns to gold. Is nothing beyond his reach? Sisu! Sisu! Yes! Who can stop Daniel Goldfinger? Seriously, that's going too far. Erico, Erico, look! I got a sponsor, nail polish. It's Robin Egg Blue. Sponsors, huh? Daniel, I pulled a few strings. You're gonna like this. I got you more sponsors. Wow, really? You know there are two things I never joke about. Business and, and plastic, plastic surgery! surgery. Yeah. <laughs> okay then, first off. Solid 32 karat gold watch. I got you the small model, 2.8 kilos. Uh, I think it's a little heavy, Erico. Oh, you ain't seen nothing yet. Bronze ring from the heavyweight collection, timeless. Steel claw, medieval line, the skull is cast iron. Sterling silver with a diamond finish. Because sometimes, you gotta treat yourself. Wow. The Arctic Expedition Mitten, triple thickness. That's enough, Erico. I can't play with all this on. Not without your falconer's glove and your Kevlar oven mitt, that's for sure. Stop! I already can't lift a finger. How am I going to manage on the field? Well, that's your problem now, Daniel. We're committed now. I've signed the contracts. Hmm? Hmm? Daniel, semifinal starts in 30 seconds. We're waiting on you, champ. You're not gonna throw in the towel over a little thing like this, are ya? <laughs> Goal! Daniel Sisu carries his team through to the next round after playing the entire match left-handed! Is there nothing he can't do? What is this? Captain Sisu! Captain Sisu! Yeah! And a big thank you to my sponsors. Captain Sisu! Captain Sisu! That was a close call, Erico. Good thing I can play with both hands. Yeah. Good thing. Yeah. But now's where it gets tough. We're up against the Jaguars. In the final. The Jaguars? Yeah. They're the most dangerous team in the tournament. I hear they'll stop at nothing. Stop at nothing, huh? Whoa, it's dark in here. Is anyone there? 
Ah, uh, Danny, come over here. You and I should talk. Here's our offer. I think it could be good for you. If the Jaguars win the final, you'll get a year's worth of luxury hand care for delicate skin. We offer you an entire year of luxurious care for your hands at the Intensive Deluxe Beauty Spa. Whoa! Uh, no, I can't. My team is counting on me. Think it over, little guy. I wouldn't want anything bad to happen to you. Nails break so easily. Sorry, my answer is no. He said no. <sighs> You don't leave me any other choice, Daniel. Daniel Sisu, could you follow me, please? Care to explain this? Some hand cream with a scent of orange blossom? It was found among your things. You know it's strictly forbidden by the rules, right? No, Daniel, not you. Tell me you haven't been dabbling in that. What? No, uh, that's not mine. I would never cheat. We'll know soon enough. Mm. I'll let you off this time, but I've got my eye on you. <sighs> Erico! Erico! Someone tampered with my stuff! Daniel, you weren't disqualified? But why are you saying that? I haven't told you anything yet. <laughs> That fragrance. <laughs> that delicate natural perfume. You smell like orange blossom! You're the one who planted that cream in my stuff so I'd be kicked off the team! Fine, I did it. But it was for your own good, Daniel. You've been impossible since you started playing here. That's not true. You're just jealous. I'm better than you at finger football and you can't handle it. Better than me. Better than me. Better than me! Forget it, Erico. I'll play in the final without you. Who does he think he is? Just because he's captain in the World Cup final. Ugh. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Daniel Sisu's team is crushed by another goal. You could at least have got us seats for the final, Dad. Shh. Listen. Things are not looking good in this final for the reigning champion. The young prodigy seems to be out of sorts. What a sorry sight. In my 20 years on the job, I've never seen such a sad player. Oh no, Daniel. Ooh, Sisu misses another ball. He just cannot seem to keep his head in the game. Uh, what? Tackle takes down Sisu. Is this the end of the road for Daniel Goldfinger? Get up, Daniel! Yeah. Come on, you can do it! You're the best. And I should know, because you're even better than me. Mm. It's incredible! Sisu has just gotten up! He's broken away alone towards the goal! It's the final minute! I'm speechless, ladies and gentlemen. That's my Daniel. See, Erico? Now we're both champions. Yeah. Well, if you ask me, there's still one of us who's a little bit more of a champion. <laughs> What's round and gorgeous? No, not me. It's you, little cookies! Those meringues smell great. They're not meringues, they're cookies for the Hazelnuts Bake Sale. Eh? The Hazelnuts Bake Sale? Every year we sell cookies at the sports fair to raise funds for the team. Wow, this is really good. I don't know about football, Daniel, but baking is definitely your game. I added a secret ingredient. Hazelnuts. <gasps> How'd you guess? What's your favorite nut? The name of your football club? The Hazelnuts! On your apron. The ha- hmm? <laughs> The Hazelnuts! 
Wow, you're one smart cookie. Hey, paws off, naughty glutton. Oh, there's Daniel. And his delicious cookies. This is the year we're going to strike it rich, hazelnuts. We'll finally be able to afford chin guards! Ah! Yay! Those dulcet tones. Those perfect harmonies. That smell of warm laundry and of sweaters around shoulders. The Tennis Club! Ethically sourced and freshly baked. Come get your cookies before it's too late. They're so good looking. This is unfair competition. <sighs> I guess it's another year of bruised shins for me. <laughs> Sorry, guys. You know what this means. <sighs> Oh, hold on, you're packing up? It's a losing battle, Erico. Every year they steal our customers. We're not gonna be pushed around by tennis players. Such nicely combed hair. Such white teeth. Such nicely combed hair. Trust me, Daniel. If I know anything as well as I know football, it's... Hugs! What? Huh? No. Free hugs? Would you stop it with the hugs? Kisses? Marketing, Daniel. Selling stuff. What? Business, Daniel. Business. There you go. Thanks, and have a nice day, sir. Hello, sir. Care for a cookie? Mm -hmm. Wait, there aren't just cookies in this jar? <gasps> oh! 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 Look at all these filthy rags! I'm going to the stall across the street! We did it, Erico! But are you sure it wasn't too mean? There's no friendship in business, Daniel. That's how business goes. Yay! Business! We're getting those shin guards! Shin guards? Come on, you need to aim higher, Daniel. New turf, new bleachers, a water park. Wow, but we'll never make enough money for all that. Not if you work like that, that's for sure. Uh, uh, uh. Hmm? Yeah? What do you want? Uh, I'd like a cookie, please. I'm kind of busy right now. Oh, can I have a cookie, please? What is she saying? She wants some cookies. What are you saying? <laughs> Hi, I'll take a cookie, please. Uh, thanks, and have a nice day. <laughs> you didn't give me back my change. Oh, yeah. Silly me. If you don't motivate your team, you'll never fill that piggy bank. <sighs> Do I need to encourage them? No! You need to fire someone to motivate the others. What? Trust me, in business, it's fear that drives people. Think about the new turf. You wanted to see me, boss? Um, <laughs> yes, Steven. Uh, sit down. I wanted to see you because, um, um... Hmm... Say it! Say it, Daniel! You're fired! Uh, what I wanted to tell you was, uh... I knew it! You're promoting me, right? My wife's gonna be so proud! Huh? Hmm. <laughs> Just a minute, please. I can't do it, Erico. Steven is part of the team. Bench your feelings, Daniel. Just fire him already. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, 
here, Steven, but your results are lagging behind your co-workers. We're gonna have to let you go. What? <laughs> That's my boy. Thank you for your help and take care. Oh man, what am I gonna do? I'm sure you'll find a way to bounce back. <laughs> my wife is not gonna be happy! Think of it as a new opportunity. <laughs> I knew you had it in ya. See, that wasn't so hard, was it? Hmm. <sighs> Hello and thank you. Hello and thank you! <laughs> Hello, thank you. <laughs> Now, that's what I call a productive workplace. We can do better. Huh? To save time, no more saying hello or thank you effective immediately. <clears throat> we'll also be using more flour and less chocolate in the cookies to bring costs down. You sure, Daniel? People seem to like this recipe. That's an interesting opinion, Maple. Why don't we discuss it further in my office? <laughs> Congrats, Daniel. Remind me never to work for you. <laughs> All right? You know what I'm Perfect timing, Eriko. I wanted to speak to you about further cuts we can make. Ah, that's my little money shark. Okay, then. Spill it. By my estimation, that's your 16th cookie today, right? Yeah. Sorry, Eriko, but you're eating into our profits. We're going to have to let you go. What? But you can't fire me. We're not just partners, we're friends! There's no friendship in business, Eriko. Think of the new turf. <laughs> you can have half a one. Consider it your severance pay. created a monster. Daniel is out of control. How do I bring him to his senses? Ah, what is this? Blem. Blem. Daniel, you've got to taste this cookie. Blem. No time, Erico. I'm busy doing the books. Taste! <sighs> hmm, a bit dry, and the new flower is a bit bland. Notice anything missing? <laughs> there are no hazelnuts in this cookie! Bingo! What have I done? The hazelnuts! Senior! Maple! Ah, the lure of a quick buck. Classic mistake. Happens to me every time. Hmm. <laughs> How do I make this right? Hmm. Hello! Mm -hmm. May I try one? Hmm. Wait! There aren't just cookies in this jar! Mm -hmm. Hmm? There's also years of expertise! A deep concern for a job well done! And a pinch of cinnamon! Uh -huh. <sighs> now that's a cookie worth biting into! Yay! <sighs> there. Everything's back to normal. Yep, and at least we learned something. And earned a wad of cash. Uh, uh, in fact, I may have spent it all as an apology. <laughs> what? <laughs> 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 
Every time, every time we practice, it's always the same. Come on, guys! We can do this! We haven't scored a single goal in the whole tournament. We couldn't even beat the Pee Wee team. <laughs> but they were so cute! We're never gonna win a game. <sighs> Thanks for trying, Daniel. Hey, see you guys back here tomorrow, right? Who's the best? No, it's our butts! We are, we are hazelnuts. Wow, are they lame or what? They are not lame. All they need is a little... Oh. Here we go! I have written an awesome speech to motivate the team. Hey! That was one of my top ten goals of all time! <clears throat> my fellow hazelnuts! My fellow hazelnuts, my mom always says you have to believe in your dreams. That's why I want to... <coughs> I want to... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Big money, big cars, big watches, and big money. That's how you motivate a team. That's not the only way. Self-confidence is really important, too, you know. Also, we don't have any money. Oh. Okay, forget it. For starters, you guys need to stop thinking like losers. We're doing our best. Said like a true loser. Trust me, Daniel. It's time for a little action. You sure this isn't cheating? What are you talking about? You can't cheat at practice. It's not even a real game. Yeah! No cheating! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> here, here. Come on! So proud of you, Hazelnuts. <laughs> awesome, Erico! Our plan worked! That's nothing. Fasten your seatbelts, people. The Batana machine is ready to rock! <laughs> No ifs or buts. We are, we are hazelnuts. My little hazelnuts have blossomed into solid oak trees. Come on, you guys. Now let's get back to practice. Pfft, what for? Yeah, with skills like these, who needs practice? Let's go see a movie. Erico, I think we made a big boo-boo. Nah, they're super confident now. I mean, that's exactly what you wanted, right? Hey, our new theme song. Ozzernut, Ozzy, 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 Nut, Dance Team Around. Ozzernut, Ozzy, 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 Nut, You Can Dance This. Awesome, right? Isn't it a bit, uh... Aggressive? Ooh, first comment. The Crushers? They're the most brutal team in the league! Those girls have sent all their opponents to the hospital! Those girls? Don't tell me you're scared of a girls team. So, you guys are the best around, huh? <laughs> Tomorrow, your turf. Go! <laughs> Step 
up on it, Daniel. The next plane to Putacana leaves in an hour. We can't let our friends down. We have to save them. Uh, didn't you guys see the video comment? Oh, chill. It's all good. We'll eat those crushers for breakfast. For breakfast! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we've made a lot of progress, but, uh, we're not ready to take on the Crushers yet. What's with all the loser talk, Sisu? Yeah, you're kind of bringing us down. Bad vibes, Daniel. Very bad vibes, man. Uh... Who else thinks Daniel's being a party pooper, hmm? Uh... Thanks a lot, Daniel. I barely got to the food table. We're doomed, Erico! We're all gonna end up in the hospital! The hospital! We don't have a choice. We have to tell them the truth. What? You mean the whole truth? Everything. That you're Erico Platana. That you've been turned into a ball. That we cheated at practice! No one can know that the great Erico Platana has turned into a ball! Sorry, Erico, but the team always comes first. This is too important. Wait, 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 wait. I know. Tell him you're, uh, the... Uh, the ball charmer. <laughs> no one's gonna believe a dumb story like that, Erico. Hey, everyone, listen up. Oh! Come back to Earth. Yeah, you think we'd believe a dumb story like that? <sighs> okay, but I did rig the training session. I'm a ball charmer. But if you're the one who controlled the ball, we're dead meat. Which one of you pipsqueaks is the team captain? Mm. May the best team win. Well, have fun, kids. And don't forget, you're stronger when you stick together. Good luck. Hmm. Hello, hazelnuts. My mom always says you have to believe in your dreams. That's why I want everyone to think very hard about victory. Are we good? No. Will we all come out of this alive? Maybe not. Have we lost every last one of our games? Absolutely! But today, we're going to be victorious, my friends! You know why? Because we never, ever give up! Come on, Hazelnuts! Let's go! Wait, couldn't you just play the flute instead? <laughs> You're right. My speech was totally lame. I'm a terrible captain. It was beautiful, Daniel. Come on, pick up your flute. Play for your team. Play for victory! <laughs> <laughs>
was fun. See you for the rematch. Who's the best no ifs or buts? We are, we are hazelnuts! You know what, Erico? They might have scored 48 times on us, but I've never seen the team so happy. I can feel my face. So happy. Finally! You almost missed my top 100 corner kicks. Sorry, Erico. I, I wanted a brioche from the bakery, but I got lost on the way back. So, where's your brioche? Daniel? <laughs> Somebody took it! What? <laughs> ah, stealing from a child! Who did this to you, Daniel? Who? <laughs> Come on! We're going back there! What? Uh, I don't know if that's a good idea, Erico. I don't like to lecture, Daniel, but I'm gonna teach you a golden rule today. Never let anyone kick you around. Listen up, Daniel. In a fight, look him right in the eye. Never apologize. Yes, Erico. You're avoiding eye contact, aren't you? Sorry, Erico. You just apologized. I mean, sorry. No, 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 sorry. Oh. Don't worry, Daniel. I'll teach you how to make people respect you. You ever been in a fight? Me? What's your problem? What's your problem? You got a 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 problem? <laughs> <laughs> So, who was it? Who stole your snack? The chubby kid over there? <laughs> okay, was it the tall guy over there? <laughs> really? Hmm. It's not those two weirdos back there, is it? The tattooed bald guy? The female bodybuilder? The crazy guy talking to himself? me. Nobody can hear us, my friend. There we go. I see him. Over there. <laughs> it's the swan. He stole my brioche. Wait, <laughs> that's your bully? <laughs> Seriously, Daniel, at your age, mugged by a fat pigeon? Be careful, there we go. It's just a bird, Daniel. What's it gonna do? Easy, my friend. There it go! Watch out! Ah, it's fine, Daniel. It's just protecting its nest. Swans are social animals. Reaching out shows it that I'm a friend. Easy does it. Easy, buddy. Okay, Erico? Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. It just surprised me. Now we get down to business. Business? Business. Tell a responsible grown up. That's what I mean by business. Warden! That swan stole this kid's snack! It's outrageous! Well, that swan there. Yeah. Slow down, little piggy. No. Oh. Hmm. Oh, come on! This is all some sick trick! I know your little games! That swan is vicious and violent. It's a real sicko. You're my best friend. That bird's as gentle as they come. Can't you get your snack back yourself? Oh, unless you're scared of it, of course. In that case, no problem. I totally get it. Scared? Me? Scared? Scared? Puh. Lots of people are scared of birds, you know. Lots of people. Just say the word and I'll take care of it. He'll take care of it. What do you think this is? Scared. Do you know who I am? Scared. Ha, <laughs> yeah, right. Better not complain if some feathers fly. You're really going to do it, Erico? You're going to beat up the swan? The golden rule, Daniel. Never let anyone kick you around. 
<laughs> hmm. Uh, listen, I I'd rather avoid any violence in front of the kid. How much do you want for the brioche? Five? Maybe ten? Oh, would you prefer a bank transfer? <laughs> You okay, Erico? Yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm I'm fine. You sure? I'm telling you, I'm fine. Come on, let's go. I'm I'm fine. But what about your phone? I let him borrow it, okay? And what were you doing in the park in the first place, huh? Showing off your brioche. Oh, uh, I always walk through the park. Well, from now on, go around it. Or take the bus, I don't know. But that takes longer. Just don't go through the park anymore, okay? End of discussion. Erico, aren't you gonna turn on the TV? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. <laughs> Blown by our famous <laughs> craftsman, these collectible glass swans will embellish your home with a touch of grace. You okay, Erico? <laughs> it's just a commercial. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I'm fine. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm completely fine. Can I sleep in your bed tonight? Nighty night, kiddo. Nighty night, Mom. Nighty night, Erico. Mwah. Okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. fine, fine. Ready, Ashlyn? On this baby, I can go zero to 60 in only four seconds. <laughs> You're so cool, Erico. I can't wait for you to meet my parents. <laughs> swans, swans, swans everywhere. Oh, the the necks are so long. <laughs> Get away from me, swan. <laughs> Don't have to be scared anymore, Erico. The nightmare will soon be over. Ah! Daniel, you up already? I'm going back to the park, Erico. We can't live in fear like this. What? You can't do that. That thing will shred you to pieces. Too bad. I'd rather fight than be afraid. And I don't like seeing you this way. You... You do that for me? You've never actually been in a fight, have you? Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, Erico. I got this. Wait. I won't let you go there. Not without me. The golden rule, Daniel. No one kicks us around! I don't see it. Too bad. Let's go home. There it is. Hey! We've come to take back our stuff. So you better get out of here if you don't want any trouble. <laughs> Has it gotten bigger since yesterday? With the two of us, we outnumber him. It was nice knowing you, Daniel. Charge! Charge! <laughs> Thank you.
So, I popped at least three stitches and we're banned from the park for life. Worth it! So worth it! And I'm not scared of swans anymore. Same. Nobody will ever steal my snack again. How come? Yeah. It tastes like mud and pond water. Yeah, eat up, Daniel. That's the sweet taste of victory and justice. <sighs> oh, kids these days, always up to no good. <sighs> but never forget, if someone's bothering you, tell a responsible adult about it. And never hurt animals. It's dangerous for you and for them. <gasps> No littering! Paper goes in the trash or the recycling. And hey, Terry, if you're gonna ride your scooter, wear a helmet! No one ever saw the hook again. But they say that he's still out there, somewhere, waiting for his next victim. Oh, no! And he always chooses a child named... Not Daniel, not Daniel, not Daniel! Daniel! Some have said that he found work as a bus driver. Ah! Hi, Daniel. <laughs> That's not funny, Eriko. Mr. Clump has a hook, but he's nice. That's right. Now, oh, come on. I was just pulling your leg. If you keep doing that, I'll never believe a word you say. Tamea, put that gold down! Maya, there's mud all over your shoes. Larry, no unicycling inside. Ow! It marks the floor! See you later, Eriko! Hey, guys! What's up, guys? Marcus, how you doing, girl? All good, Ping? So, uh, Robbie couldn't make it? What? He's missing? Since when? Robbie? Robbie! Robbie? Robbie! Who did this to you? Stay with me, Robbie! Stay with me! Come on! Come on! Hang in there, Robbie! Think of your wife and kids! <laughs> Robbie! <laughs> That's enough! Just a second, kids. Hmm? Ah, that's better. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel! Daniel! It's terrible! That's just an old deflated ball. That's Robbie! He was like a brother to me. Maybe he just went flat on his own. Robbie would never do that. He was full of life. We went through so much together. This was murder, Daniel! <laughs> murder! Hey, you're just trying to scare me again, aren't you? No! This time it's all true, I swear! Erico? Don't believe me? I've got witnesses! <laughs> They've all disappeared! Uh, there's no one here. Like I said, they disappeared! But who? Marcus! Valerie! Bing! You named all the balls in the gym? No! Well, yes. That's beside the point, Daniel. Someone has kidnapped them! Erico? Someone is going after the balls in the gym, which means there's a... Ball deflator! A deflator. Hmm. Okay, you animals. Time to hit the showers. See you tomorrow, Daniel.
We have to find the deflator. You want me to be the next victim? Knock it off, Eriko. <gasps> I know you're making this up. You think I would lie to you? Wait! If you won't help me, maybe Detective McDaniels will. I don't know. He's pretty busy. I'd be surprised if he could. Even if I had his trench coat and his hat. And his magnifying glass. Detective McDaniels, did you call for my help? I'm working on a lot of cases right now, but for a friend of Daniel, I'll see what I can do. Okay, thank you, Detective McDaniels. Can we go now? Two minutes on the case and still no leads. The investigation is going nowhere. What are we doing in Maple's office again? Oh, Daniel, a vegetarian in sandals with a ponytail? He's obviously deranged. Maple can't be the deflator. He won't even harm a mosquito. Easy, little gluttons. Aha! Marcus's beret. You tell me that's not evidence of something. Maple's always had a weird fashion sense. And he does love his hats. Fair trade and trendy. What more do you need, Daniel? You want me to be the next victim? Is that it? Sorry, Eriko, but I just don't think it's him. Get up, get up, get up. Snack time! Go on, McDaniels. Have your milk and cookies. Who needs ya? See what I think of your card, McDumdum. <laughs> Oh, it's just you, Maple. You scared me. I scared you? <laughs> Why would you be scared of me? No reason for that. For being scared of me. <laughs> See you tomorrow, Maple! <laughs> See you tomorrow. Marcus? Valerie? Ping? Here, guys. What do you want on your waffle, sweetie? Maple syrup? Maple? Yeah! A vegetarian in sandals? I scared you? <laughs> I just love maple honey. Maple syrup? Maple? Maple. 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 Erica was right! Maple's the deflator! <laughs> Where am I? Marcus? Valerie? Bing? Who did this to you? I'm sorry you'd had to come to this, kids, but you leave me no choice. Maya, Maya, how many times have I told you not to scream in the plastic cones? This isn't all fun and games for me, you know. This hurts me more than anyone. <gasps> and you, Larry. My knees are shot from cleaning up your unicycle tracks. <gasps> and as for you... <laughs> I'm such a scatterbrain. <laughs> <laughs> 
And as for you, Daniel, we don't play with switches. I know you're the one who made a mess in my office. Nobody move! Ah! McDaniels to the rescue! You better start talking or else! I confess to everything. I live in the gym, and I'm the one who's been deflating the balls! I don't know what's wrong with me these days. <sighs> I'm full of rage and negative energy. Hmm. Can I see the box for your herbal tea? This isn't herbal tea. This is super energizing tea! That's why I was so cranky. I should have known something was up. Thanks, Daniel. You're welcome, Maple. We all make mistakes. And we all get worked up from time to time, too. <laughs> you got that right. But seriously, stop playing with the switches. <laughs> we'll miss you, Robbie. Rest in peace, old friend. Another case solved by Detective McDaniels. I can't believe you let Maple off the hook. Maple was just another victim in this sordid affair, Erico. Hey, nice trench coat, Daniel. Don't worry, Erico. Crime may never sleep, but neither does McDaniels.